You guys ready to find some treasure? <laughs> Oh my god, he's naked! He looks like, um, just a straight up frog. Or maybe like an alternate baby Snorlax, like a, a Lolan Munchlax. Anyone want this bulb? <coughs> Alright, let's open up some treasure. Guaranteed real gold dip treasure inside! We get three treasure blocks. I have always been very, very interested about what the hell this shit was every time I saw it on the shelf. It looked very enticing. I think the same company now is also doing these aliens that you dissect. A lot of people tweet that at me as well. It says we have 28 levels of adventure, whatever that means. Let's see, we find the map, we rip the gold layer, we discover the dragon's eye secret, uncover the dragon X tool, then we dig and chip the rock, then discover the dragon's bones, build the dragon, find the dragon's heart, pour the dragon ooze, and number 10, reveal your treasure. That's only 10 steps, where the fuck is the... 28? Oh shit, choose your quest? That's just the dragon's quest? Then you've got the mini beast quest and the treasure... I think this is just making it all seem a lot cooler than it actually is. Uh, this is a product by a Moose. I know very little about it, so let's just... Cra Ooh, okay. This is, um... There's a hell of a lot going on. Alright, adventurers, let us take the map. That's where we start. Ooh, it's gonna be tough to navigate this inferno. Look through the dragon's eye to find the X and reveal the treasure you may find. On the quest for the Hammer of Glory, in search of the serpent statue, the pursuit for the dragon's potion. I just know we're gonna fuck this up. All right, so we have this, which is what? The dragon fucking X tool thing. Then we've got, God, it's, it's heavy. Three different quest levels, I think, um, Maybe we'll start off with the big one. I'm not a pussy, we're not gonna set on easy mode and run under the tap. So first, we've gotta peel this back. Oh! I don't... Whoa! Okay. This is awesome. Wow. The dragon's eye. Okay, so, we take the dragon's eye and we use it to locate the treasure. Holy shit! This thing's cr- look! You can't actually see different stuff. We can see there's the treasure X right there, although we can kind of just see that through the paper, but this really does work. Uh, it works a lot better on your actual eye. I feel like this would be a blast if I was a kid, but, you know, I'm the next best thing. I'm a man-child. Um, so we have it over the dragon's potion. Now what do we do? That's the treasure we may find in here, is that what it's saying? These ones are common, and then it says ultra rare gold dip treasure. So I think we might be getting the dragon's potion, boys. And then we've got all these extra things at the bottom. Okay, step six. We're gonna dig our way through the rock, and then we're gonna discover some dragon bones. Alright, let's try. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use our tool here. We should be able to sort of drill. Oh, okay, boys, we're in. We're cracking the vault. You can actually drill into this bitch. I be working on the railroad. Gonna end up with a hell of a mess on the desk. We have this other tool that you can bruh, bruh, sort of bruh, stab, I guess, bruh, into the bruh, fucking bruh. top with. Then you've got a scratcher. Then you've got the old scraper. I much prefer to use the smasher. Would you look at that? I think we've found something already. It, we have just completed Dragon's Potion. Wow, thank you. Wow. We were a little underleveled, but we got the job done early. There's a bunch of um, dragon oof, bones in this thing here. We've got a dragon leg, Ugh. dragon tail, Dragon wing, some more dragon feet, another dragon wing, the last dragon foot, and, of course, the dragon's big fucky skull. And look, he's just been eating dirt, idiot. Alright, we're definitely gonna have to wash this. Ah, we've also got, um, it's like his rib cage, and for some reason that one specifically comes in plastic. Just sort of get into that. And we'll start assembling him. <laughs> you boys want to share a beer with Legend? It's like a sip of Legend's beer. All right, let's chuck all these fucky dragon limbs in here. Give him a little shake. 
And we're good as new. Just use that tool to get any excess cum out of its mouth. Just like taking him to the dentist. Then we can start assembling our dragon. Get his tail on, put on leg, put on leg, put on leg, put on leg. Very easy to assemble. It clicks in very, very well. And there we have it. That is very cool. Golden dragon bones. There you have him. Now, the next part of our quest is to find the dragon's heart slash treasure hunter chest, unwrap and open to reveal the dragon's ooze inside. Did you find gold? So it looks like there might be some sort of RNG drop right here. And then finally, you can display your shitty dragon, the golden dragon heart and treasure. Treasure hunters can be displayed holding their treasure, whatever that means. All right, let's crack this ooze. All right, here we go. We've got the, oh, that is such a cool color of purple. I really, really like that. All right, there's, um, it seems we kind of, it's in, thought there'd be more ooze, but there's like just a hard capsule inside. Don't worry guys, just use your fucky dragon tool and we see what we get. This is gonna be the real gold dipped treasure, I guess. Sort of interested to see what this looks like. We have, wow, okay. I think it's guaranteed if you buy it in the big treasure box, but maybe a lot harder to get if you get the uh, smaller random ones, but here it is. We have some apparently real gold dipped uh, treasure, which is this one, the Pursuit of the Dragon Potion, which we found on the map with the X. I wonder how much this is actually worth. I mean, close to nothing considering it's in a fucking children's toy. I mean, in terms of, um, Gold, anyway. Well, that was an interesting one. We have a couple more quests to go, though. Peel back the dragon's foreskin. Ooh. Looks like we've got treasure, boys. Treasure ho. Oh, okay. Some sort of, um... Ooh, a green skeleton head. Are we missing pieces? Is there any... Oh, oh! Okay! He's always dangerous. He's got a sword. Some other bits and pieces. It is quite satisfying to dig through the rock. Fuck. Kobe! Come on. Come on, baby! We can get it. Come on! Let's make this a little more interesting, huh? Woo! Ow! Fuck! Yeah, don't do that at home. Okay. Alright, we're just gonna leave this boy dirty. Real gamers don't bathe anyway. All right, so here we have it. An epic skeleton. Ooh, spooky. He's almost the kind of green that looks like he might glow in the dark even. All right, we have a, another thing. Ah, fuck you, why, why do I, what is wrong with me? Small brain? Wait, fire equal hot? All right, we have, um, ooh, this one's got, um, it's like this skeleton's emblem on it or something. We found this in the dungeon, boys. We're cracking it open. We have some more slime. I really, really dig the color of this. If I was um, a couple of years younger, I'd probably try to eat it. Hey, if I was a couple of videos younger, I'd probably try to eat it. They said it's non-toxic, right? Right? Right, guys? Right, guys? Right? Right? <laughs> All right, so I think we have one of the much more common totems. We have, um, kind of looks like a little Chinese man with that hair. Give the goblin some loot. All right, that calls for this last one uh, to make a little bit less of a mess before I peel back the skin. I'm just gonna give a little, a little whack. All right. We have a double? Oh no, okay, he's um, he's like a smaller little gremlin. He's the money goblin! He has an actual dollar sign on his head. What ye What are we supposed to be doing here? Trudging through some deep Skyrim dungeon or just going to the bank in China? This is a, a, a very sorry excuse for an artifact. It doesn't even make any sense. It's a radioactive barrel. It's just a, it's just, it's just junk. Nuclear can. It, it just makes no sense. Man, I wish I had a golden sternum. There you go, guys. Um, it's, it's, it's Blingbat. What a shitty name. I really like this one, though. Tre the Treasure Orc. I think I put his arms and legs in the wrong holes. It looks like he has 
cerebral palsy. We'll polish him up. Ah, thanks for watching, guys. This has been <laughs> fucking dog shit, as usual. I wouldn't have it any other way. Let's open up a Pokemon pack. We still need to do our burning shadows for this episode. Don't worry, Eevee. I've got some purple slime to add to your collection. Now, this is where we play the gambling game of will he or will he not pull the Charizard while his fingers are covered in dust. Um, this is going to be a risky one here. We flip this around to give you guys the code. The, the, it's just like fucking goo and dust. Oh god, it feels horrible. Here we go. We've got some bodybuilding dumbbells. We've got a fat kid on the floor. Oh, they're, they're getting stuck together? What's happening? We've got ink... <laughs> ink... What is this? Ink. We've got pal Palo Sand. On the very end, thank god, Slow King. Alright, thanks for watching guys, my name is MaxMofo Pokemon, if you would like to buy any of the MaxMofo merch, you can do so by clicking the link at the top of the description. You can buy a shitty hat, or a shitty t-shirt. Also, if you want to buy anything else from shirts with a Z, dot cool, you can use code MOFO for 10% off. Make sure you tell your friends that's code MOFO. Does not include YouTuber merch, but they have a, a whole selection of all sorts of stuff. Click a video on screen if you want to see that, or... Don't, oh no mate, I'll probably see you in two days, maybe three days. Well, it depends what, how I feel.